Uh, so I put on my ND4 filter to let in more light to my camera. And we're gonna see how it looks. I'm gonna go up into the air. Um, I'm gonna keep it on cinema. Let's see, manual. And we're just gonna see what we can uh, do real quick. It's like it's gonna rain. So I'm just gonna do like a little quick video, but my GPS is working now. Maybe I can do follow me, but so I'm gonna take it up in the air and we'll set everything up and get up in the air. All right, precise home is set. So, all right. That's a little bit more. That's still dark. Right there is not. And this is an ND4 filter. It's not letting in. It's letting in light, but not a lot. So. So let's see. Let's see a little bit of jaggedness. Since we have GPS on both our drone and our controller, so right now I'm gonna pan it down to me, okay? And what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna do follow me. In tracking mode, you just see if it tracks me. I'm just gonna walk around. Let's see if it finds me. It's not finding me yet. Oh, subject lost. So let's do it again. Let's do it again. Hold on. So I'm really high up doing this. I got it on track. I'm gonna lock it. Now you see if it follows me. It follows me around. Walking. Let's see how long it takes to find me. Oh, there it goes. <laughs> Cause I walk back towards it. So I have it locked. So I walk back over and towards my bag. See the drones moving back. Come over here. See if it follows me. It's supposed to be locked on me. See if it loses me. I'm 
close out the frame, subject loss. Too close. 